Badger medicines. Badger medicines make things go downward. Actually, the badger is considered an herbalist's um, friend in the Indian pantheon of animals because it burrows under the ground and it checks the roots and everything. And, it, and it's very much concerned with quality. My friend Paul Redox said, well, out in the Dakotas you can see the badgers a lot easier because here, well, this we're in the badger state. <laughs> But it, white open prairies are good badger country. Badgers are tough animals, so I like that Wisconsin badger state. <laughs> <laughs> we got the little gopher, <laughs> Minnesota gophers. <laughs> so uh, yellow dock root looks like a little badger, kind of. And it's a very good remedy for the stomach. Cools the stomach, it cools the appetite, cuts down sour things, kind of cut down on the salivary excess, cut down, and that kind of cuts, tones the appetite down a little bit, and it's also, and the acids like maybe make the food more acidic and cut down on the hydrochloric acid, and, and it just in general cools down the whole gastrointestinal tract. It's a good remedy for esophageal reflux, um, colitis, and enteritis, or Crohn's disease. It's helped with that, too. Yeah. And it cools down the digestive tract, so all the way down to finally bleeding hemorrhoids. So, and it can be for constipation or diarrhea, which is funny. You'd think mm -hmm. it's going to be only for one or the other. A dead giveaway for it is... Um, Yellow around the eyes, nose, mouth, and red on the cheeks. Someone said, oh, that would be fire in the digestive tract in Chinese medicine. The yellow is the earth element, and the red is the fire. Earth element is the digestion. Then it can cool down the gallbladder. If the gallbladder is affected, if, if the general constitution is, is, is too hot, because some of the gallbladder remedies are cooling, and some are heating, like chelidonium is really heating, so that's going to be good for like a cooled off, uh, cooled off person. And the gallbladder is underperforming. It's maybe needs stimulation, needs needs stimulate the gallbladder. Whereas yellow dock root, you're maybe inflamed, and the tender gallbladder. I would think I don't know from experience. I've only used it once, and it did work. But um, the person seemed hot, and so therefore cool them down. And um, you're going to have a more tender gallbladder, and it's going to hurt a lot. And um, then there's the bitters like ceanothus, which aren't really hot or cold so much, but are just stimulating. And burdock and um, dandelion. Dandelion can slowly get rid of gallstones, tendency, all of the above. Many, many good herbs. So yellow dock, and then it has eczema, That's especially if it's weeping, serum, or like yellow or clear fluid with red red moist outbreak very specific otherwise just for a damper type of eczema with a, as an assistant remedy to go with would be dandelion barberry root and the badger is actually a fairly sacred animal like knowledge spiritually knowledgeable the badger is considered one of the small the smallest bear even though it's a, a big weasel, but um, <laughs> but the Indians consider it a small bear because it's it's the only animal that will take on a grizzly bear. And one of my friends even saw in M Montana or North Dakota where well, one was along the road and it was like trying to scratch the tires of the trucks as they went by <laughs> and try. <laughs> <laughs> Um, let's see, so some of the purgatives and things that help things go down might be considered badger medicines too. Um, like at the sun dances out west, that the Indians, before going into the sweat lodge, they would take a, they have the sacred dock it's called, but it's kind of the same thing, and they'd have a tea of that, and they called it medicine of understanding, and it helped you to understand spiritual matters, which 
it's kind of surprising for yellow dock. I mean, it seems like such a mundane plant, but but badger is a very profound spiritual animal. To the, like the Cheyenne, their great prophet was named Sweet Medicine, but his uh, animal was the badger, sometimes called badger. He said, 500 years, 800 years ago, he said, well, there'll be these invaders from across the ocean, and sorry to say it's really going to be a hard time. There's nothing you can do about it. But I'll tell you one thing. Don't eat their food. <laughs> <laughs>